Hey look, those giant death robots are cooperating with the XCOM units in order to get things done. Now I think it's important to make sure that we're always producing either XCOM units and or giant death robots. It might have been a good idea to amass an army before invading Siam, but you live, you learn. As long as the enemy stays out of Russia's borders, we should be alright. We'll keep men in Siam in order to fuel chaos. If you find an unguarded tile, pillage it. Giant death robots always enjoy good pillaging. They daydream of plundering trade caravans. It's not so much a full-scale invasion as it is an occupation. Moscow makes things a lot quicker than St. Petersburg does, but every little bit helps. You can't expect towns to have the production capabilities of a capital. There's still four more uranium left. Oh, a giant death robot died. There's still five uranium left to make more giant death robots, though. Not sure if we should go back and protect the homeland or maintain our stance here. It's important for everyone to get their anxiety out by attacking the adjacent tile. They don't have a target, they'll go find one. Bazookas are a great thing to aim at before they aim at you. Seriously, those things will ruin your day and then some. But hopefully they can be trampled. New policy means a great general and some bonuses. It's important to keep your great generals guarded at all times. So when moving them, make sure they have an escort. It's nice to know St. Petersburg won't be attacked by the sea. It's kind of vulnerable out there on that strip of land. More and more Siamese soldiers have spawned. Makes Catherine nervous. Luckily, the National Defense Program is still active. The XCOMs and GDRs are doing an excellent job at harassing everyone else. It brings a tear to my eye to see them cooperate so well. Sometimes your escort has places to be, so the great general is left in the forest alone to fend for himself. Finally might get freedom to pass his world ideology. Yes, it worked. And the failure to repeal the non-proliferation agreement is nice too. I really don't want to deal with nukes from the sky. They are too dangerous. This war is about terrorizing the enemy face to face, so fighting isn't a surprise. You're all wonderful little units, each and every one of you. We need more XCOM units everywhere. Everyone fortify and prepare for the next turn. May you all be able to take another command. Ooh, science! That'll be perfect for future tech. I love future tech. XCOM squads are fighting for future tech. What else could they be fighting for? Freedom, actually! I forgot, it's the world ideology. Siam has lots of targets, but hunting for workers has always been one of my favorite pastimes. Now, since we don't really know what's going on in Lampang, we might have to send a robot south. He will check things out. Hey, look! More marines. The thing about these marines, though, is that they've been trained to fight. These are the marines of the future of the future. Greetings, Catherine of Russia. I am a scientifically advanced, par par partially robotic laborer designed to perform A. Please do not delete me. No. Why isn't this marine dying? Ah, oh, that one too. It also lived. They better not go pillage our uranium. That's like war crimes. I don't know if we're even going to need to build anything other than XCOM units or GDRs. Now our unit production isn't horrible, but it'd be nice if we had some sort of ceasefire in order to get things ready. A ceasefire to prepare for a non-ceasefire. Train a few more troops and get ready for the ultimate destruction of the Siamese cities. Of course our great robots are doing a fine job, but it's just they haven't slept in days and these robots need some sleep. More than half of them are on autopilot all the time. It also seems Siam has no problem spitting out soldiers. It's like he's got a wormhole to some dimension where there's a lot of military training going on. No, I think that this tactic will work because, you know, we're just gonna negotiate some peace. I said negotiate peace! Ugh. We need a blockade. We need to embargo Siam. Now what we really need to decide is whether we heal this robot instantly or give it some sort of promotion. Mm, yeah, feel better. Until next time, on Operation Russia. Thank you.